let's go. Okay. Uh, what am I doing? We should return to King Giot, the Dwarven King, to see how the battle fares. So funny enough, for a little bit we actually resurfaced because we were escaping um, the Red Baron slash uh, Golbez, Golbez's army. But let's uh, see what the king has to say. Oh, you've returned. I've been waiting. And what of the crystals? Nope. <laughs> we failed. I see. Golbez has been hard at work attempting to acquire the last one. He is now trying to force open the sealed cave's entrance. It is only a matter of time before he succeeds. I was hoping you might go and remove the crystal before he does. Luca! Yes, father? Bring me your necklace. Here you go. This necklace, you see, is the key to the sealed cave. No one can pass through the entry point without it. Please, you must protect the final crystal. We will try. Obtain Luca's necklace. Alright. So now, I don't think we even have an airship. Yeah, we can't cross the magma in the Falcon. So, I'm not sure what we're supposed to do. Because we can talk to people. Uh, I don't know. Let's uh run around first, maybe. There's something out here that we can, or somewhere out here we can go. That will allow us to upgrade. I think, uh, I remember Sid, before he sacrificed himself, said there's something that we can get to kind of modify the ship to allow us to really fly out here. And he also said it was from Mithril. So, I wonder if we can resurface and go there. Oops. Can we even resurface? <laughs> it's a real question. Because uh, again, we have to cross the magma in order to be able to go anywhere. However, uh, we can't really do that. So. I'm not quite sure what we're doing then. I have forgotten <laughs> from my other playthroughs. I would like to maybe go back up to the surface and maybe uh, Mithril would have been able to do something for us, but um, it also doesn't help that Sid is no longer with us. Uh, and I just tried to uh, resurface, but it didn't let me, at least. Maybe I need to press a different button. I was pressing circle. Because <laughs> usually circle allows us to ascend. Maybe I can try to hit X this time. If not, I'll go back to the castle and see what's up. Oh. I guess we can't. Yeah, because that's definitely the way back up to the surface. So I guess uh, let's just go back to the castle and see what he has to say. remember what to do. I guess I can talk to just random people. Holy into a surface caved in not long ago. It made quite a mess down here. Oh, we rescued a strange old man from the rebel. He's recovering the infirmary. Infirmary. Does that mean Mr. Sid is alive? Uh, question is, where's the infirmary? But yes, of course he's alive. <laughs> I already knew. I was just trying to keep it suspenseful, but it's already been spilt that uh, Mr. Old Man Sid is alive and kicking. Just gotta find a way to get to him. I don't know where the infirmary is. Uh, East Tower. Yeah, I don't really care to go. There. I would think it was like by the inn. Maybe someone can tell me where the uh, infirmary is. 
Mm, I don't think it's up here. Is it? It's the bar up here. So, no. It's a secret tunnel, I believe, so no. Maybe here? Yeah, here. It's Mr. Seed! What, is it time for dinner again already? I tell you, the cuisine down here could use some work. If I have to eat one more... Sid! You're alive! Put on a real show, didn't you? <laughs> Who's this old codger? Codger? Did that unmannered lout just call me an old codger? You're the unmannered one. Who is he? Who is this snot-nosed little brat? Heh. I'm Prince Edge of uh, Eblon. Pleased to make your acquaintance, old man. He has a foul tongue, but the matter of his royalty seems true enough. <laughs> Let's not forget my dashing looks and mystifying skills. Edge, please, the miss. this man's injured. Ha! So he has got you reined in with that pretty little face of hers, eh? Quite you. What's become of Golbez? We defeated his four archfiends, but he still holds all of the crystals save one. We would go to secure it only if the Enterprise weren't still up on the surface. Enemy ship we still cannot cross, cross the magma. Hmph. <laughs> Doesn't sound like you can do much at all, does it? Guess it's up to me again. I swear you kids would never get anything done without me. Sir, you must stay in bed. At least until you've healed. We young folk are quick to recover. <laughs> There's no time to be lounging about. If you want me on my back again, you best come and lend me a hand. <laughs> so I got a ship to modify. He certainly seems well enough. Indeed. Yeah, so pretty much all the Final Fantasies feature features a dude named Sid. And he's always his engineer. Slash, like, flying guy who wants to fly. He is the master of the skies, more or less. <laughs> He's just, like, hammering random stuff. And it's crazy that his wooden hammer can, like, you know, hammer iron and steel. <laughs> That's uh, Final Fantasy magic. <laughs> now he's hammering the air. <laughs> uh, it's that Sid magic. Not to let you fly over anything you want. Thank you, Sid. Sid. He's sleeping. Zzz. Seems to have worn himself out. He always pushes himself too hard. Sid, thank you for everything. What's this? That's a letter beneath his pillow. I'm writing this letter in case the worst should befall me. If you're reading this, I suppose it has. Make sure you give all those baddies an extra whack on the head for me. We owe it to our late king. No, we owe it to everybody in this world. Even these people down here with their lousy food. <laughs> and please apologize to my daughter for me, for all I put her through with my selfishness. All my love, Sid. Obtained Analyze Augment. So that means we never got... Well, I don't think we ever use Sid again, actually. Which is kind of sad, because I have all these hammers and stuff, but... Only Sid can use hammers. Anywho. Let's get the hell out of here. Actually, I want to go up that those stairs right there. Okay. Yeah, I don't really use these augments. I don't know. It'd probably do well if I did, but I just don't know who I would use it for or on. Uh, let me see. I believe we get to a point where I only have five. No, I'm gonna have more than the five characters, and I can switch them out interchangeably. I think that's probably what took me so long to beat it previously. I have this uh, this OCD thing where if I level characters up, I want them to level up uh, at the same rate as everybody else, so everyone to be at similar levels. Uh, for this particular playthrough, I think I'm gonna try to not worry about that. Um, I'm kind of just get the best party I want to use. Oh yeah. It's a secret village over here that has next tier weapons. I don't know if I can buy it actually. Yeah, this is actually just uh, 
forge for legendary weapons. Now I'm just running. Oh, who's this guy? My smithing days are done. I'll go with a different way to so uh, forge another sword. I cannot find the legendary adamantite. And without it, I could do no greater work. Yeah, I don't have one of those yet. So. So much drop. Oh, I believe those uh, increase maximum MP. Uh, does anybody really need MP? No. That's kind of the problem with these, like, uh, boost items. Like, And plus, I'm playing on easy or casual, normal. This is home of Kakal, the finest smith the world has ever known, Lali. But, uh,. I play on normal, so it's like not really a need to really maximize on anything. Master Kokal's forge has all but gone cold. He does nothing but sleep these days. I feel like that's kind of the fate of all what master uh, tier artists and craftsmen. It gets to a point where it's like you've done everything you, you set out to do, so you want to like work on something even better, but you can't do it if, again, you don't have all the between inspiration and actual like tools or whatever. So that, that guy, he's kind of just sleeping his days away because <laughs> he's pretty much done all he wanted to do. More or less. I think that's a sealed cave right there, actually. Uh, I don't know why I'm trying to uncover all the map for. This place doesn't give you any special items for 100% the map, and even then, I can't even 100% the map. Because that little square down there. Uh, can't be the OCD, man. Oh, there's another cave right there. Uh, I don't remember which is which. There's another cave right here too. Uh, I think that one actually was a sealed cave. And this one's just another rando caves. Which I'm gonna go in, so let's go and save. Let's get some exploring done. Oh, this is a sealed cave, so I was right. So let's explore the other places. with this one. Do I want to go here? I don't know. Well, I guess this fight one enemy. There's actually... So there's lava everywhere, right? And so there's a way to bypass stepping on it. Well, not teleport. No! <laughs> Oops. Wrong one. And that skill is float. As you can tell, float has this float. Oh. I passed through this way when I left the Fey March. We should seek out Leviathan and the others and ask for their aid. Yes, please. Okay, if I can survive pretty easily, then I'll go ahead and fight through this. Uh oh. Oh, miss. Excellent. Yeah, I believe. Um, well, I should actually. Oh, I guess I don't have to. Usually, flying types are weak against thunder and wind. We'll see. Nope. Maybe it's weak against nothing. Oh, it's indeed. Um, I guess so. It's not too bad, right? Pretty decent experience, but I believe this is a somewhat a secondary area or like optional area we can go. Blood eye. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yes. Need to know your weakness before I can. Oh no. 
Ah, oh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. No weaknesses, so let's bio because it's cheap. Let's try to raise Cecil. It's still for fun. <laughs> Let me get that. Oh, conceal. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, yeah, Kane's still sleeping. This whole time. Boom. Alarm clock. <laughs> for uh, those who are sleeping. I believe any attack. Uh... Oops. What am I doing? Mm, use Rosa. Oh, I probably should use the end. I don't know why she has such low uh, thing above. MP. Phoenix Sea down. This is like a secret pass this way. Uh, ether. Oh. Oh yeah, uh, Tornado, I believe on in most Final Fantasies, they reduce one's HP to very low amounts, like critical amounts, so that's why uh, Cecil is pretty much at zero. Go back. <laughs> I really shouldn't worry about 100%ing these maps. And about the dragon. And the dragon should be enough to kill. Didn't do as much as I was thinking it would do, but didn't if. I think technically I'm not like really s level enough to really like easily go through this dungeon, but I think I'm strong enough to get through. Just try not to stay too long. Ah, what? Oh yeah, I think uh, osmosing works pretty nice on these, uh, I don't know what you want to call them, blood bats. Not death. Uh, uh, yes. I thought really it really needs MP, but oh, I didn't get anything. How sad. Yeah, pretty much it's an easy dungeon if you can just auto attack everything, which is nice. Oh, let's get that little piece right there. Not 
got that. Oh well. Wow. Just one hit from Kane and one hit from Cecil killed one of those gargoyles. So much MP. Alright. I believe there's supposed to be a spider enemy in this area. Oh, I'm just, again, not paying attention to the terrain. Oh, man. Death. I wonder if bio uh, the sap kills, or does it stop at 1 HP? I guess we'll never find out. <laughs> mm, gold needle. Because I know sap again drains HP per second, but does it drain it all the way to zero, or does it stop? Oh, somebody is not floated because they died. Oh, why did they die? Oh, there's a reason why I hesitate on doing that, because it actually takes away from everybody. <laughs> if you cast it twice, it uh, unfloats you, which is kind of weird, to be honest, but... It's how the game's programmed, so... Not the deaths. Yeah. I think if it doesn't kill right away, like the second it, it like activates, then it misses. Man, Edge goes really quick. I believe he got a second turn before Cecil and Kane got another one. in that bottom piece there. Oh. oh wow. I didn't think it'll do enough damage. I guess three of them did hit him. Edge Cecil and then Gridia. Then the final percent will be at the door when I go to the next area. Who knows so much drop? Alright. We get a new set of enemies, yep. I guess. And I'm assuming uh, everything's weak against holy, actually, now that I think about it. Ow. Oh, except for the Fell Knight. So definitely the imps are weak against holy. It's definitely pretty much demons. That's really draining a lot more for healing. Let me look at 
much. Is he gonna do too much? Yeah. I'll try to whittle him down so I don't have to wait too long for the sap to potentially kill, but I guess we won't find out quite yet. Oh yeah. It's been a long time since I've had a uh, new armor, actually. Now that I think about it. Oh no, someone died. Or maybe just the float wore off. Yep. Okay, I didn't take that much damage. Oh yeah, she's like a summoner. Oh yeah, she does uh, earth attacks, yep. But I am floating, so no effect. We can get ice. Well then, eat some ice. Oh. I think I remember that it was weak against ice. Oh, she <laughs> analyzed the same thing twice. I guess that's why you would want to. Uh, Actual analyze. Prayer unanswered. Sad. Ooh. Yeah, definitely the magic isn't as potent as it used to be with the other enemies. Uh, these enemy stats are definitely higher. Don't summon another one. Oh, retreat. Oh. And it won't re uh it won't drop gill or anything, which is sad. But we still level up. Okay. It's just auto attack. These guys are weak enough to just take it in the face till he die. out today and my shoulders are very stiff. My neck and shoulders I should say. I also played a lot of volleyball yesterday too. Went to two locations. It's been a while since I've done that. I played at my normal spot and then uh, it's one of the players last week so I wanted to go up there just to Play some more with him. Um, competition wasn't that great at the second location, but I mean, you just go to have fun, right? It was pretty decent. Uh, it's kind of what I expected. Um, I didn't like over or outplay everybody. Kind of. Whoa. Radio. Why? This is actually kind of bad. <laughs> so it's wow. I was pretty much hoping that video would just cast her dragon and everything would have been cool, but I think right now Cecil should be able to cover everybody. Indeed. Ah, <laughs> right around to. Oh no! All right, we just run anyway. It's not worth it. Not 
not worth it. Those back attacks definitely suck. Okay, again, with this little like map mini game that we do, it pretty much changes the whole game and to me just looking at this overlay map. I don't know. Uh, overlay map and just hoping I get everything. Oh, paralyze. Not the death. Okay, we're good. It looks like one prayer heals enough to do like, I don't know, five to six cures, which is pretty nice. Because I just need Rosa to have enough mana to cure. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We all unfloated again. You know, I'd rather have these linear maps, because I don't like backtracking, because again, we might see more enemies. Oh man. Oh, they didn't kill her. Just... Huh, that was strange. Sword for Edge, new axe for Kane, and a high potion for no reason. Just gonna get giants. Need for poison. What if this one's better then? Yes. Oh yeah, itch. <laughs> Checked everybody except for itch. Uh, Kiku Ichi Monji. I've seen that name so many times, but I just forget how to pronounce it like quickly. <laughs> so I have to like look at it and sound it out. That's the one thing about Japanese. It's pretty nice. All you have to do is kind of just sound out the word. The syllables are pretty straightforward. Let's get some shiva up in here. Mm, poison, yes. Earthquake, yes. No, poison doesn't do that much damage. I wonder if it's like a percentage of the remaining HP is how much poison does. So again, that makes sap that much better. I remember uh, before when I didn't do the uh, bam, the float trick that every time I seen the arachne they just wipe my party but then I figured out oh just float and we can just dodge <laughs> all that damage easy I 
I don't know where this is taking me, so I'm just gonna kind of tilt myself up. So whenever I get to the other part of the path, I'll just automatically go up. Just auto attack everything. Yes, Rosa. Doing that damage. Hopefully, it's taking me to a treasure room. I also hope this treasure room is connected to the room to the left of this place. Yes, okay. So I don't want to backtrack through the. Oh, no. I don't want to fight that like this. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I would fight it if I wasn't back attacked. I might even fight it if I was just regular surprise, but this back attack is just terrible. Even though I don't know, again, how strong that particular monster is. I feel like, you know, I'm able to fight all these people, so, all these enemies, so I shouldn't be too worried. Oh, wait. I don't think I 100 percent of that map. Win second. Back attack. Hate back attacks. Run away! Oh, take off auto battle. Let's <laughs> see, Edge! That's so funny. Oh, I didn't drop any guild that time. It's pretty nice. I didn't take any damage either, right? Because they just gazed instead of actually attacking. Okay, here we go. Let's get this thing's ass. Oh. I hate sometimes the directionals are kind of sticky. So I'm going to like <laughs> try to select something else, but dang, that's a lot of. See, I try to go to bio, but then it like stuck. Jesus, let's get some shell on everybody. I mean, I feel like I can just auto attack it to death, but it's gotta be safe. You know? Play cool. If I can stop this thing, not like it really matters, I guess. Oh, it's dead, anyways. It's dead. Just finish it. Finish him. Oh, nice. 5200. That's a good chunk for a single enemy. Defender! Enemy ambush! I believe it was a Cecil weapon. It's gonna protect everybody. A minute for the long haul. Oh, bye. Damn, they didn't die from that. It's okay. This is dead now. Yeah. Right, I think the defender actually it definitely increases defense, but I wonder if it is holy damage in this game. Let's check it out. It is not, but it gets defense. That's all that matters. 
Uh, yes. The Logo Killer probably does more damage. I don't know. I don't remember how they calculate damage in this game. It's always like a calculation between your strength and your actual attack. But. Uh, you're by yourself, hey? Hey. Oh, I didn't even need to use Earth or uh, the Zaga. I think the Defender Strike will kill it. Yeah, give me that MP. Oh, did I miss? What? What? It's dead, though. Yeah, it's pretty crazy that, like, these auto attacks can miss. Because we're kind of, like, expecting it to just hit, because it's just, like, a normal attack, right? But I'm going to still, uh, definite, uh, really, yeah, you returned. When they have all the treasure chests marked for me, that's nice. What was I talking about? Just auto attacking missing kind of sucks, but I guess the evasion and then the uh, accuracy skills or uh, attributes those dictate whether or not you hit. So yeah, that's the teleport to the next level. Ooh, rat tail. I can give it to that one dude that likes rat tails. Best theory. Really, it's been some time, hasn't it? It has been some time. It's really, I already mentioned earlier that, uh. Oh, Chocobo. It's Eidolon. What is it? Is it strange for you to hear me speak? You're in the land of the Eidolons now. I wonder how he freed this these days. Hot headed as ever, no doubt. Cast Float and Titan can shake the earth all day for all that a good it will do. Chocobo, Shiva, Ramu, and all the rest reside here. Eh, let's go ahead. That's a lot of monies, but I'd be great. I'd be grinding that gill, so. Welcome. Ooh, light curtain. I wonder if I should invest in some of these. Though, I could technically only buy 10 of these. Jesus. I have a lot of them, though, so I don't really worry about that. Cast Stop. Cast Berserk. I have eight of them. Sandals. Blink. Reflect. Oh, I'm thinking, like. Wait. I'm thinking Final Fantasy X. Light curtain in that game does protect, not reflect. Uh, Star Curtain does reflect in Final Fantasy X. Interesting. Well, I don't need it regardless, but... Yeah. Treasure chest. Bestiary. Phoenix down. Let's go ahead and save. It would probably be better if I just used a tent. Instead of Using 1200 gil, you know, again, that's chump change. Really, I'm so glad you're back. You see, I need your help with a problem. Did something happen? Our friends went off on a trip and never came back. They were supposed to be back today. Okay, I will look for them. And if you find them, tell them to get back to town. You will. Oh, you're a lifesaver. Any idea where they've gone? One went to the desert. They're supposed to see something called an oasis. Thanks. We'll go look around. Well, that's one. So pretty much this is a mini game where you go look for all the dudes. It's gotta see your face again, Rydia. Cause we can be Rydia while we're here. Just some, it's not awkward. Oh, Rydia, are those your human friends? This is our library, stars of arcane lore and wisdom. The king will not lend ear to your words unless you have proven your strength in a battle against Queen Ashra. Or Asura. Don't leave us again, Rydia. I could not bear to say goodbye to you again. Again, especially because time flows differently here. 
Our weapons are not made for human hands. Are you sure that you can wield them? But yeah, now this is a surprise. Alright, let's get some whip whip action. Damn. Kotetsu. I love how it says it's not for human hands, but here we are with uh, Kotetsu. I'm pretty sure I can probably find one in the treasure chest, but... Eh. Let's go ahead and get it. Get it. Get it. Uh, let's go ahead and get one of those. I don't really need shurikens. I should I just get these staves. It's for magic purposes. Let's just get one of each. Everything else is good. Because lately I've just been using uh, staves. Plus six intellect. Yeah, sure. Uh, aura staff, spirit, accuracy. There's no. Heals target. Honestly, this might be slightly better. Because it can heal without uh, using MP. This one is just if I guess if I wanted to cast holy attacks, which she doesn't have any right now, so let's try using this for a time. See how it's like. I also have to wait. Edge just got a new weapon, Kotetsu. Kotetsu. Just for more damage. Um, let's go over to the armor store over there. You shouldn't bring out the humans here without good reason, really, huh? We do here in quiet seclusion. Welcome. Wait. I need a shield. So buy one of each. Some good stuff right there. <coughs> I just realized the uh, these stabs increase spirit. So I wonder if spirit does like boost white magic, and then intellect boosts black magic and summoning, or is summoning like a combination of both intellect and spirit that increases its uh, input or uh, output? I don't know. I should really sell these old stuff, but that's okay. Uh, I'm actually gonna go save again, actually. I said actually twice, but. I was gonna hit that save, because as we saw, we have to fight Queen Ashra if we want some Idolin assistance. So let's go beat some Ashra ass. Hopefully I'm a uh, high enough level to do so, I don't, I'm not 100% sure. Though if anything, maybe just tactics is good enough. But we'll see in a second. I feel like if we can get to here, we should be able to beat him. Right, I've never read a more fascinating tale. Hush, this is a library. What? I didn't see nothing. I said nothing. These are just stories about uh, the Eidolons and stuff. Which I don't need to really worry about. Uh, Chiliad, I could spend within this place, and still would there remain tomes I have not read and secrets I hunger to know. Have humans mastered the use of ink and quill as well? Yes, <laughs> we have actually. Yeah, I don't really. Uh... This is the audience chamber of the king and queen of the Idolans. I don't really know like exactly how long it took for them to, or us, <laughs> if I say humans, to start developing written language, but um, definitely in the BCs, of course, if it's like block printing or you know chiseling. 
Well, again, that guy said, uh, what do you say? Do we master quill and ink? So, that's probably what. Maybe even AD. I don't know. I don't know if there was writing like B late BC. Anywho, let's go, uh, the Dolan King? Oh, no, youngling. I am but a feeble old man. Ashra, though. Your Majesty, really, it's so good to see you again. And well, please, Your Majesty, we have need of your strength. Then I shall lend it to you. But you know I must test, must first test your own. It is the code, and the code must be observed. Have you the courage and strength to face me? Yes. So be it. Fight. Uh -huh. I believe the way this fight works is depending on the face that she is, uh, she'll counterattack depending on again what uh, face she has. So yeah, that face is a cure, like she cures herself. Try to steal from her, and then that face raises. Uh, and shell. Uh, enemy has no items. Let's go ahead and buy all this B. <laughs> uh, let's defend for a second. Okay, so I'm fully defended. Rivia is about to cast Bio, which is always nice because it's slowly. Oh, you don't want to attack her with that, though, right? I don't know. Let's just mess her up. Go ahead and jump. Uh, okay. It's just auto attack. Let's dispel her crap. Oh! oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm not ready to face her then. Got one shot of there. Oh, jeez. Wait, what? I wonder if I should reflect on her. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. I don't think I'm ready for this. How about I just. I'm gonna be smart, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and blink. Wait, Mirage, right? What I'm going to do is, I'm going to let the, uh, I'll let the bio kind of do what I need. I'm going to hopefully get a dispel off on her. And then I'm going to reflect on her. So I keep defending. Phoenix down, on Rydia. All right, cool. Because again, she is bioed, so she's continuously taking damage over time. I think I, if I can just sustain, survive for all this time, that should be okay. So even then, I'm not even gonna do anything with anybody else. So it looks like she'll only counterattack, and then she'll keep healing herself. So if I put on reflect on her, she'll just keep. Uh, Helping me out, hopefully. Because again, she's, all she's doing is casting white magic if we do nothing. <clears throat> but it's just once we attack her, that's when uh, she starts doing stuff to uh, us. <clears throat> so I already biled her. Oh no, the bile wore off the. So let's, uh. Kinda take a page out of uh who's their faces. Take a page out of the uh Delta Sisters. What were they called? Uh okay. Just give the bio honor. Uh, 
Oh! <laughs> Not enough to survive. Oh, uh, didn't raise Cecil, unfortunately. I'm taking this nice and slow. Why, thank you. Oh. Uh, again, I don't really want to do anything. And I believe uh, Reflect does wear off eventually. I think it just did. Oh, Jesus. Where are you? Oh. Reflect on her again. I don't think Sap uh, runs out, though, so. Just as long as, uh, just stay alive. Then eventually I'll attack her, but... Just to test how much, uh, HP she has. Now I wonder if this is, like, the best way to fight her. Probably, right? Especially if I'm not, uh, leveled enough. Okay, the sap wore off, so I do need to reflect myself. And then cast bio again. Okay. So bounce off and hit uh, Ashra. Of course, I will have to. Hopefully, not die. Sasha counterattacks. Yeah, ah, oh, she did it again. <laughs> That's okay. Maybe she'll raise me. Yes, 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 yes. Good stuff. This might take forever because again, I'm not attacking. I'm just letting uh, the damage just roll. Uh oh. I do need to cast reflect on her again. I don't know if she healed herself for 2,000 something damage. I might get impatient. <laughs> End up, uh. Just attacking. How much HP does she have? Because maybe I can gauge it somewhat. And honestly, if I just blinked everybody, it wouldn't be such a big deal either. I don't think everybody has, or only Rosa has blink actually. Oh yeah, it's actually cast protect on everybody again. I really don't want to attack though. <laughs> Stuff. Bio. Nope. Sap is gone. Alright, I'm gonna chance it. Go and hit her with some dragon. Uh, let's give everyone blink if I can have it happen. Oh, 5,000. Some good damage right there. Yeah. Oh. Shots are doing good damage on me, too. I really do not know how much damage she has. Or, like... Her being able to heal herself like that sucks. Kind of fortunate that uh, we can't all just blink ourselves. I mean, I do have some decoys, but that's only for one hit, not 
by multiple hits. Too bad I can't blink everybody too at the same time. Uh, Vidya. Yeah, I really wish uh, Seesaw had blinked too. That would have been nice. Also running out of MP. So going to get rid of some MP. All right, go ahead and do it again, girl. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get ready for the counter attack. Try to go too crazy with the attacks, but. Oh yes. Oh no. Ooh, I think I get three times where she'll miss. Uh, I probably should have bio first, so I didn't have to. Oh, I'll just wait. Uh, what else we got? That's pretty cool. Uh, Blink gives you three, three uh, dodges, pretty much. Yeah, I really shouldn't be attacking her like that. Yes, <laughs> I cheated to victory. Woo! All right. So I don't know if I can do the same thing with Viathan, which is the other. Dude, I'm about to fight. So, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I definitely felt that I came here a little earlier than I should have, but we're here now, so let's might as well uh, go fall it. Sweet, Rydia. There are good companions you have found, both strong and true. Allow me, too, to lend my strength to your cause. Summon me whenever you need. Rydia learned Ashra. Cool. Nice heal first, obviously. I am almost dead. Or at least I'm out of MP for a lot of them. Uh, again, I don't think I could uh, do the same tactic against Leviathan. He's a. Uh, oh. <laughs> it's gonna suck. That's all I've got to say about that. Uh, let's see. Party. Yeah, we just need to use the end. I'm gonna try a couple times. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it, so. Try a couple times, and then I'll probably have to come back. Yeah, once I level up a couple uh, levels, because I don't think I have any like armor or anything that will defend against. No, excuse me. Uh, Leviathan's onslaught. Because mm, the issue is, uh, I believe he gets to go twice. And he also hits AoE more often than not, I should say. Uh, I wonder if I could uh, kind of cheat him out and do... Here, let's just set it up now, actually. Oops. Uh, draw attacks. Bring it to edge. Because he can do the blink, right? Mm -hmm. So I'll blink, draw attacks. I wonder even... Oh, where am I going? I wonder if I could actually Berserk Leviathan, which is... Sounds terrible. <laughs> but Berserk him so that he only auto-attacks. That's what Berserk does. It make, makes you stronger, like gives you more attack. But all he can do is auto-attack. Which might be the best thing I could uh, hope for. Vidya, child, you are the first and only to best my lady queen. But strength of arm alone will aid you little in the face of true evil. Without the strength of will to keep it aligned on the proper course, all the power in the world amounts to nothing. 
My spirit has been tempered and honed in the forge of the ages. Will you face me, knowing that what it means to do so? Yes. Faith I should just probably slow the battle speed down, actually. Alright, Edge. Uh, see, I don't even have time to, like, do anything. That probably killed everybody, huh? That killed Edge. Great. <laughs> Shit. Let's jump on this fool. Yeah, I don't think we can worry about too much. That might have killed. Nope. Kuraja, please. Heal us. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think that killed everybody else. Nope, just killed Rosa. Can't kill our healer. What does Blizzaga do? <laughs> Speaking of which, yeah, I'm gonna have to restart. Now Ridia's dead. I A have to slow the battle speed down. Oh, I'm not sure what that does. Poison, right? Oh, that killed us. We did. Wow. <laughs> even with Shell, uh, I still take all that damage. So, all right, let's try that again. Let's slow the battle speed down, because again, I don't start my own uh, attacks before it's too late. Let's also change it to wait. Let's do that fast, I guess. Alright, so let's try it again. I guess that's the cool thing about this game. Uh, if you die, they just uh, bring you back to where you died, or right before you where you died. Alright. So first, let's check to see if I can berserk this guy. But yeah, I think he always gets. Yeah, the first, uh. Oh, he didn't die. Shell. I think I have Bacchus wine, right? There it is. I can't give it to him. I don't want it. Give it to him. Rosa, heal us. No, heal us. Heal us. She's pretty much just gonna be doing that the whole match, I feel. Boom. Yeah, I think Kane must also just keep jumping. Let's go ahead and buy this guy too. Out of here. I don't think. Let's go ahead and throw actually. Throw some shurikens at this guy. Nope, never mind, we did. Yep, yeah, Rosie's just gonna keep healing. I don't think she's gonna do anything else. I can't afford to do anything else with her. I didn't even check to see how much uh, using Dandaga does. Jeez. I should have waited till uh, Kane dropped back down, but that's okay. Unfortunately, I don't think. Well, he did drop back down, but I don't think. Um... Oh, I should put slow on him. I forgot. Throw. Okay, so it does. Oh, it doesn't heal Kane though. Kane's about to die. Kane's dead. It's okay. Let's Phoenix him down. Phoenix down. Good. Kirasha. I need to slow, but. Oh, it's not. Ah, shit. You're so slow. 
think I need to. Oh, yeah, we're done. I think I need to Hermie Sandals Rosa because she needs to be able to move like instantly. I feel like this is really doable. I should also bile him first instead of using Ruma. Okay. Try again. I guess it's just a lot of RNG. Well, they're not, uh, we get that far. Oh, I didn't even change speed, actually. Yeah, this is bad. Uh, oh, myself? Oh, he's dead anyways. He's yourself. Yeah, I didn't slow down the game speed. Yeah, we're all dead. We're not all dead. going. It's gonna be hard because again I had to like menu really quick if I want to survive. Yeah I think Kane's gonna keep jumping. Oh shit. Never mind. Well Kane's dead. I think it's faster to just... Oh Kane's not dead. What's happening? It's 6500. Sucks that I, <laughs> I didn't mean to just heal her by herself, but... Oh no, Kane jumped and I didn't heal him yet. <laughs> it's gonna be really tight, actually. Can't believe... I think I'm just gonna keep, uh... Keep Edge dead. He's gonna have to hold that L. <laughs> he's not gonna do anything, he's just gonna keep dying from the deluge, so. There's no point of trying to heal him. Well, Kane's dead now. Maybe he's not dead, though. It's definitely gonna be super close. Between Bio and uh, using Tandaga, I think it's going to be very close. I'll have to tone it down to just this. I wonder if I can slow him down. I should be okay now. I think I'm gonna win. Just gotta make sure my MP is uh, at a good, good amount. Might have to bio again, actually. Oh yeah. Yep, he's slowed now. That's good. I'm still hasted. Uh, let me keep you doing this. Let's buy it. actually. Still sapped. Nope. Let's go and sap him again. If I had a rise, I would try to raise everybody. Let's see if I can berserk him. Nope, he's just dead. Woo! Tactics, baby! Yeah, we're gonna get some major experience here. So normally I would grind already. Wow, that's a lot of experience. I would have grinded a lot already. So I can pretty much just auto attack to kill, but yeah, I'm only under I'm under level 50 actually. Indeed, you bear the light. Very well, go with the power of the Idolan King at your command.
back to the inn. Because <laughs> the Idolin King just paid me for kicking his butt. That's a good feeling, because, like, I mean, normally I would super grind so that fights like those wouldn't happen, where it's, like, very close like that. <clears throat> but, again, luckily, Rydia and uh, Rosa are both magic users, and Cecil just tends to have a lot of uh, spirit in himself, <laughs> so he, they all three of them have good uh, magic defense. Let me just go ahead and save that. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't take too long to do this portion. So now I can move on forward. But yeah, so that's like a mini side quest to get uh, two of the uh, hidden Eidolons. There's one more, which uh, we'll get later. There might be another one too, actually. But I'm not sure if I remember where to get it. Oh, uh, I believe the way out down here. Of course you can backtrack through the blue teleporter here, but I think there's even a better one this way. This is like a secret teleporter. Because it doesn't really look like a teleporter. Um, then there's some treasure chests up here. Let's see what some items we got. Yoichi arrows. Elixir. Yoichi bow. And dry ether. So even then, I think having the healing staff gave Rosa more spirit, right? <laughs> so it gave her more uh, defense against magic. And yeah, I'm all the way out now. Excellent. Alright. One more place to explore, and then I'm going to go ahead and move to a sealed cave. It won't let me land on the dirt, pretty much. It's kind of funny. Mm, self cave. Oh, I need float. It's also some poisonous stuff from walking on right here. <laughs> so, yeah, when there's a. Uh, poison on the ground or anything hazardous on the ground just cast yourself some float pop pop ooh one it KO mm, that means it's gonna be a quick trip through the self cave wow that gave me like no <laughs> experience bestiary angel arrows uh, I think I should probably come back here when uh kind of the open world aspect occurs. Oh. Can I not go any oh no, I forgot about these dudes. Let's get some Ifrit up in here. Yep, that's what I was worried about. Bad breath! Oh, confusion too. Let's get some Esna on Cecil. Oh, he got pigged. Fire! Yeah, if you got. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> I was like, what happened? Back to normal. Whew. Spider Seed could. That's funny, it's like. So there's one enemy, like, group that gives you, like, no experience, and then there's that enemy group that gives you, like, all the experience. <laughs> Pretty funny. Yeah, I don't think I can go to the left, right? There's no like hidden passage way. There's a hidden item right there. I see it. I see it. Uh, <laughs> so why is there just one enemy? What kind of waste of time is this? I'll still take it though. Secret hat or oh, that's like BS right there. Like, why can't I get that? <laughs> what a tease! 
What a tease. Uh, wait. Taking a, a snow myself. Yeah. Not the bad, the breath. Oh, jeez. Not the bad breath. No. It's okay. Yes. <laughs> Poor guys got frogged. Oops. Yeah, it's definitely a tease. They like put a secret passageway, but then you can't get to the actual item that's there. Despite the secret passageway. That's just mean. Tink. <laughs> oh. I didn't know they could do that. Maybe that's why they're so weak. <clears throat> so if you don't one-shot them, then you get earthquaked. So I guess we like come back in this area to finish off the map. Mm. Kinda wish there was a way to have no en oh flip war off. Have no encounters. Mm, let's go this way. What's the save? Oh wait, what? Does the float go off when you switch uh, rooms? So it seemed like. But it didn't happen in the other dungeon that we were in. Maybe I didn't notice. I don't know. so funny still. <laughs> Tease you with that uh, treasure chest. I think I might have to go back. There's a small chance that this way leads forward into the dungeon. I haven't explored the other part. Surprised. Earthquake me. Do your best. Let's not go that way. Thousand kill. Cottage. Alright. Mm. So there's some other path that probably loops up to get to the other area. This way takes us. Oh. So it does give it, or take it away. So, yeah, pretty much when you switch rooms, then their float dissipates for some reason. I, mean, I don't remember that happening when we were going through the Eidolon tunnel. Let's just keep going. I don't want to waste the float. I think I don't want to waste <laughs> these encounters either. Oh no, the frogs. The frogs. I believe that which uh, frogs us. 
Okay. Weakness. So it only needs like 2,000 damage, so maybe just doing regular blizzard would have been enough. <coughs> then again, I just wanted to kill the witch first, and then it just happened that, uh, oh, secret passage. And it just so happened that, uh, the witch just died first. Oh, yeah, we're killing this Mobro. 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 Oh, sleep everybody, that's cheap. That's cheap as hell. Too bad it missed though. Looks like Cecil cannot be uh, sleeped. Put to sleep. Oh, wow. Oh, no sap. Is that poison? I don't even know. Get out of here. Hey, my bros. I know everyone in every other in every game hate Marlboros because they're bad breath ability. Just screws your day up. Oh, that's BS too. Well, luckily, those aren't magic users, so. No weakness. Pop! Not dead. Still not dead. Mage Master Enemy Ambush! I believe Edge can. Oh no. Oh no, it's the... It's those guys that, uh... Frog people. As long as Greedy is good, I'm fine. Oh yes. So you don't spam skills, you bastard. Now eat that! Yes. Yeah, I believe Edge is the Mage Master guy. Yes. Actually, damage to mages. More speed, more intellect. Sounds good to me, actually. Yeah. It's a little less attack, I believe, but. That's an, uh... Yeah, Fortune had to go all the way back. Actually... Let's check this door. Oh. <laughs> Not the frogs. Screw your frogs. Blizz the guy, I just need Blizzara. No, it's not enough. Dang it. Wait, can I break somebody? <laughs> I told Kane to auto attack, but that's just silly. Alright, so I can just break the witch. Because the witch commands the frogs to uh, do unspoken things to us. <laughs> uh, don't really want to use 
That's not every time I get frogged. That's a waste of stuff. Ooh, lots of chests. Silver apple. Yeah, silver apple that increases HP by 10. Not that much. Golden apple does 20, I believe. Silver drop does 10 to MP. So yeah, just a bunch of semi useless items. <laughs> oh, my bro. Summon Ifrit on these foes. Oh no. I should really not attack that, because the Freak would have taken care of it. I don't know. <laughs> so funny. Frog like tries to punch. So devastating if those uh, bad breaths land. So your team's just all sorts of messed up. Okay. Again, I do believe. I do believe the uh, way up top in this region is moving us forward, so I don't want to go that way quite yet. No, Radia, I need you to buy or, or uh, <laughs> summon a free ton, everybody. It's not good. Just gotta kill him the old fashioned way then. I wonder if Flame Tongue would do more damage. I should test that out actually. No. Dang it. So, right now, um, Kane does 200 or 2700. Let's switch him out with flame time. Let's see if that changes anything. Or flame sword, I mean. There's no flame time quite yet. Yeah, I feel like those type of weapons are only temporary. Because again, their strength isn't that good later on. They're only good for in the moment when you first get them, but after that, it's like just use the other stuff that you got. Uh, let's go and save. How much damage did that do? About 300, not that bad. Let's do like a little bit more. How is our MP? Pretty full, actually. I would have just used a 10, but if we're good, then let's just keep going. Here I can use float again because we're gonna be exploring this area. God damn it. Mm, this is bad because uh, she is the healer <laughs> that uh, usually uh, reverses. When uh, people get bad breath, 
I don't think Cecil has a, a S no either. Oh wow, nice radio. I think that one shot did them. I didn't even get a chance to see how much Kane did. Or maybe I wasn't paying attention. Oh, what remedies do I have? I think I just want a maintenance kiss, right? Yeah. Yeah, she can stay blind. She doesn't need to see, she just need to cast. Again. All these status elements. You really need to kill the Malbro. Oh no, I forgot. Oh no, my control is going crazy. Okay. Rations. It definitely looks like I can't do anything. Uh, <laughs> why do I keep auto attacking? Because there's one reason why I don't really want uh, to have the flame sword out. These enemies, I'm supposed to do it again. I forget if I can't pray. Like, the pray is less likely to work if I'm silenced. It's probably a good time to see if they just die from. Uh, The sap by itself. Let's go ahead and attack it with the video. Hope it along a little bit. Oh, the sap went away. Never mind. So I can't re-sap him because he'll just die. Maybe another time. Oh yeah. Toads. Break this witch. Oh yeah, I forgot. I only have... Yeah, I'm switching the axe. Back to the axe. It's not really worth <laughs> having this here. The flame sword's too weak. Sixteen hundred. It was not enough to kill. 
Like, I still want to test the Flame Tongue against Marlboro. I know I keep calling the Flame Tongue, but it's the uh, Flame Sword. It's pretty good uh, XP for that kind of enemy, like, mob. Same thing. Oh no, four of them got to sing. Good. Might get double up, Toad. Yep. Exactly what I wanted. Already, uh, let's probably switch Rosa back to uh, offense. <laughs> Give her a sword, and I feel like this is gonna be not a sword but a bow. I feel like this is gonna be like I don't really take damage, I just keep being frogged and unfrogged, it's just annoying as crap. I think it's like that as long as the witch is still alive. Ooh, thanks. Alright. Yes. That is excellent. That is not excellent. But you can go die now, witch. Yeah, what if the frogs just auto attack after uh, the witch goes? Yes, yes, yes. Give me them those levels. Yeah, because I'm not taking any damage from them, I'm just wasting a bunch of time. Unnecessarily. Right, let's see where this takes us. New area. Let's go and cast Flip again. Uh, let's get some Ashra on these fools. Oh, that is not <laughs> an offensive skill. I did not realize Ashra did not do offensive things. I think it just... Or if it's just random on what she does. Some of the Leviathan then. I think Edge is asleep. Thank you for dying. Alright, let's go ahead and switch some of this stuff around. Let's get rid of the bow. Is it Elvin or Yoichi? They have this. Oh, I was about to say they're the same, but they're not the same. Uh, Yoichi seems the best. Well, it's pure damage. Or do I want angel arrows that might confuse? Maybe we should give her a headband. We needs defense when you just attack. Attack! That's gonna be an interesting build. Yeah, let's just bring this back to 
Poison X. Kiss Fairy Rod. That's for I already have a fairy rod. I mean, a lot of times you shouldn't really buy stuff from the shops. It's just if you're impatient. You just need it. Oh, run away from this, please. Drop my money. Let's go ahead and heal. Uh, the blindness. Mm, eye drops. Okay. So this is like a fake little loop. It is. That's so dumb. <laughs> that was a fake loop. Because mm, you think it will take you to, again, like, the other area to the right, but. Nope. All right, so I think I just had to move forward into the dungeon. Oh, jeez. All right, which? Oh, not enough. Not enough cash, stranger. Hopefully that kills. Let me just auto attack. I don't know what these frogs do now that they don't have their witch commanding them. But they can just die. And yeah, I know they're called toads, but. Let's call them frogs. Nah, let's just keep going. I was gonna go up to save, but maybe I should have actually. Now that I think about it, no, that's okay. Wait, did I go the wrong way? down so really I can just take care of him. Bang. Fuck is why. Alright, tent time. Save. Well, it's like I just went to title menu on accident. So I just wasted all that time. All right, I believe. Go to this. One. Yeah, then go to the top one. And I know I'm taking damage, but. Yeah! Alright, you gotta run. Nope, you're just gonna get broken. I know I should have cast a float, but. Yeah, I'm gonna cast float. <laughs> it's way too much damage unnecessarily. I haven't been here yet. 
I don't think, anyways. Pop, pop. 1976. Alright, Radio, you took too long. <laughs> I feel like I should just do, like, Fira or something. Save the MP. Wait, right, I do need to refloat everybody. Yeah, that sucks. I just had to keep recasting float so much. I didn't want really to cast anyways. Yeah, these status elements are super annoying. Oh my god, that's just part of the game. I think we're gonna bring Rydia back to having the whip. So she can auto attack too. What if the ninjutsu counts as magic? <laughs> so if you silence, you can't use it. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Alright, Radia. It's gonna give you the blaze or blitz whip. <laughs> I'll say blazing whip. Uh, abs lightning. That's fine. What did she say? Is someone out there? Are they hiding from us? I think I found the end of this region. They can still encounter out here though, so maybe I should get inside before I have to fight something. Too late. That's okay. Berserk? Yourself? What am I doing? Kill that mob, bro. Nice. Ooh, thousand damage, not bad. Also, not good enough. Oh, not enough. Cannot use voice. Can't Libra. That's fine. Just kill it. Yeah. <laughs> you see, even though know, they're in the back row, just still doing a lot of damage. Oh, it's dead. Is that like ping? Oh, what am I doing? I wanted magic and equipment. Is that ding of a level up is always a good sign. Uh, I'll just use S now. I'm too lazy to switch to the other menu. All right, let's go in here. Give me your goods. Oh, another one of those. 
Or a staff. Don't I have one of those? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I do. I bought one. I'm telling you, you should stop buying stuff. Eek, humans. You have no purpose in this place. Be gone from here at once. Yang, this man is called, you say? You just let him be. Oh, it's Yang. We found this man collapsed without and carried him within. His eyelids flutter like our wings, but still he does not wake. We've cared for him with all our skills, but all to no avail. Perhaps our love alone is not enough to make him well. <laughs> Slain with his eyes open. It's kind of funny. Uh, but of course I knew that. Oh. You. Go home. Have you seen you in ages? Yeah, it's been a while. You're friends with the Sylph? Yes, it's been so long since we've been since we've seen each other that I decided to stay over. That explains it. Your friend back in town is worried about you, so you should head back now. Oh really? I better hurry then. I'll come again some other time. Oh the Sylph <laughs> Sylph left with him, I guess. Oh, sure. But yeah, uh, there's really no point of going back until I find a way to uh, reawaken Yang. Alright, so let's go ahead and. Actually, I shouldn't take a free heal. Actually, I don't have to. Let's just go ahead and head to the seal key finally. So I don't really need to heal the silence from the other two dudes. It's sealed cave time. Whoa. Attack already. A die! Oh. I was hoping it would be a one shot, but it is not the case. Yes. Stunt. Can't leave that poison unattended. That's the antidote. I'm gonna do a heal. I will say they kind of recycle their soundtracks a bunch, but it's okay. Uh, Luca's necklace. Let us in. Oh yeah. Okay, again, I don't want to encounter too many peoples, but because I don't have a chant or don't have a say in the matter. Cut me a brain. Against lightning, didn't know that. A uh, blaze. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it didn't do as much damage as I was fearing it would do. I think it's gonna die before I get to attack it. Actually, yep. <laughs> I'm about to heal this guy because I used thunder on it. Oh, never mind. He <laughs> just died. It's too fast. That's oh, that's a lot of no, excuse me, experience. That's nice. Let's see, actually, if having Edge equip both of these is better, it definitely is. Because mm, there's really no mages, right? So let's go ahead and 
maximize damage output. Oh no. <clears throat> Didn't want to go down quite yet, but maybe it's a dead end down here. We'll see. Doesn't look like it. Let's go back up. Uh, <laughs> these AOE AOE magics are so annoying. Yeah, of course he does it again. You know, the first guy I already showed that it didn't work, but he just has to try to get Cecil to be uh, silenced for whatever reason. Right, let's go back up. Going up. I'm gonna go to the left over there. Could just be items. Could just be nothing. Jeez, it was just nothing. That's okay. As long as I didn't encounter anything, so I was pretty good actually. Yeah, let's try to see if I can break the Chimera. You know, the Chimera seems to have the least amount of HP. But... Yes. Yes. experience right there. Yeah, I'm gonna go... Well, let's just check in this door. It's a monster! There's no door, it's a monster! Trap door. I'm assuming I can't uh, break it. Oh, jeez. Why are you missing? Hit it. Hit it! Ninth dimension. Oh, lucky. I believe that, like, removes you from play, quote unquote, and that automatically kills. And it's dead. It doesn't even give you that much experience, but. I will take it. Ether. Kotetsu. I believe that's stronger than what I have. Nope, <laughs> it's what I already had. <sighs> Again, I think um, maybe I was supposed to come here first, normally. But I decided to uh, explore. And so I was able to get better weapons before I needed them. Though this place gives a lot more experience than the other place. Stop AOEing me! That's why you don't. Oh god, running away. Running away. It's not worth it. Run, you fools! Run. Actually, don't run. <laughs> uh oh. Okay, I think it should be okay. It's lucky uh, Cecil has a lot of uh, HP. That's OBS though. <laughs> I just got AoE to death. Some enemies be like that though. 
Luckily, we have Rays. Let me use Rosa to cure everybody. Oh, it didn't die. Must have like 5,000 XP or er, HP. Oh, shoot. That healed it. It's weak against fire, though. Oh, it's dead. Feast. Luckily, the drain or the sap doesn't like heal the bat. I think it like drained from two or three different people, but. Is this a real door? It's a monster! Actually, yeah. I have a feeling you can just holy it down. Should be weak against holy, since it's like a demonic door. Don't do this. Yeah. Oh, it looks like Cecil is actually immune to it. I think. Because otherwise, it should have said mist instead of no effect. Mm, so it's not weak against holy. It's just has like 10,000 uh, HP. Potion. I believe this is actually the way forward. It's a monster. Oh, 14,000 HP. Let's try to bio it. I'm going to try to break it next, but I'm going to bio it, see if it gets sapped. Yes. <laughs> it's so weird to have a door get sapped. Granted, it's a living thing, so. Works out. Oh no, Rydia is not immune to it. It's okay. I'll just raise after. Ooh, 7,000. Let's split against 4 instead of 5. Mm, yeah, Rosa can do it. She has a lot of uh, MP for some reason. Oop. Oh. This is empty. That's annoying. I think they're both empty, actually, now that I think about it. I should I break this thing? Don't think it'll work, but might as well try. Does it hurt to try? And anything, we should slow it. If possible. Oh. <laughs> Can't escape the death, I guess. If we can slow it though, I think we can... Yep, I think we can bypass it. Yep. <laughs> that couple seconds slow is just enough. Slow all the way. Yes, the new is empty. 
Alright, so let's backtrack a little bit, because I think that is the way forward. No, not silence. Not the silence! Reptiles are usually weak against ice. Let's just try it. Or it's just weak against swords. Alright. Let's get rid of this poison, poison. Backtrack a little bit just to complete this map. Uh. Oh yeah, and I can break the bull back there, the Chimera Brain. Break. Hopefully it doesn't miss. It doesn't miss. I guess it's like, if it works, then it's 100% accuracy. That's a lot of damage. It should be dead after this next auto attack. Everyone can auto attack it though. But it's just too fast. Yeah, that's still a lot of experience. Good stuff. I believe that's like the best combination for experience at this point in the game. Maybe even for later uh, sequences or dungeons. Because I know on the moon there are like, it's not weak mobs or whatever, but they're just not as potent in terms of uh, experience. I hope we can break you too. Just break them all. Because break saves just so much time. Because instead of having like three people auto attack it or something, just one spell cast a break is good. So if anything, this should do it if it works. Yep. It's only 20 MP, so free kill. It's like a death. And I think, um, again, some might not be susceptible to break, but they can be successful to death. I don't know when or who learns it. Um, it was definitely a... oh no. Not like this. Gotta break it. Gotta break it. It's dead. Uh -uh. Yeah, it was done. <laughs> Too bad Edge is dead, though. He's gonna miss out on this juicy experience. I believe... I'm not sure how much he's gonna give me, but it's gonna give me a lot. Especially the Edge is down. Oh, never mind. <laughs> that's BS. Because, <coughs> again, that's a very painful... Uh... You know, thing to do or get hit by just two scorch AoEs or whatever it was. And again, there's no way to increase. Well, I guess this, but I need that damage though. Magic defense. Cause I give you the silver armlet. Yeah, that's probably more important for him. Let's do it. Actually, what does that change? What does this do? Oh, this gives a bunch of defense. Oh, that's why he's like tanking the crap out of everything. Hmm. Yeah, let's just leave it. Oh yeah, I forgot. Climb back up. Uh, 
And let's explore a little bit first, just to get these chests. Though now I'm thinking this might be the way forward. Yeah, it is. The hell it is. <laughs> you can tell because like, there's the rest of the map on the top left side. And if we're just going this way, then... I can fear both of them. <laughs> Though, uh... The bat's pretty much dead, though. Yeah, I didn't have to <laughs> fear guy both of them. Oh, I didn't fear have to fear guy anybody. Jeez. <laughs> Auto attacking is still strong right now. <laughs> Watch me be wrong. <clears throat> Watch the this bottom area takes me <clears throat> to the next area. Gotta watch Cecil climb. Nope, I was right. <laughs> this was just a Patsy's item box that only gave me something that I probably won't use. Because two of my guys can, uh. Two of my guys can use. Uh, Libra. Ah, oh, <laughs> Rosa couldn't, uh, pray fast enough. Really already killed them. That's looks like that's like no experience for that sort of arrangement. But having what pretty much a succubus, Naga, and Chimera is enough to be like super uh, XP heavy. That's not even a bad combination to be honest. Oh yeah, I remember this part. I don't remember which door is an actual door, but I'm just going to go, oh, let's just pray. Well, I should be smart. And we'll see in a second. No, I think I won't have to worry about it anyways. Yep, we are too fast. As long as nobody misses, of course. Yeah. I was gonna have uh, Kane jump, because when the door does ninth dimension on him. Oh wow, it's a lot of green there. Yeah, once he does the ninth dimension, uh, Kane will be airborne. So, yeah, empty door or empty room. And so he can dodge and the uh, potential death. Ah, yep, that miss is gonna cost me. Like, I didn't even pay attention to which uh, of my guys the door targeted. Oh. Ah, oh, oh, Edge, no. No. And it's all it takes just one miss and someone gets death. That's fine. Again, we have rays. Yay, there's actual item in here. I feel like it's an ambush. This is a long trip to take this. And it's not, not even a lustrous sword. It does holy damage, I'm pretty sure. Yes. It's not stronger than the defender, but. Wow, maybe the defender's better. But that holy damage, though. We'll see if holy damage is actually worth in this area. It's definitely worth against those, uh. Thingamabobs. Oh jeez. Not the blaze. This is what the Lustre Sword's all about. 4,000? 
3600. Not too shabby. Not as good as I would hope, but... Well, at least no one died. Oh yeah. 24. I don't remember how much he did with the Defender. It should be the same amount of damage, more or less. But I think it's having the holy damage is what uh, I should keep the Illustrious Sword for. Because the only other holy damage we can do is really as a uh, summon. But I don't want to be wasting butt little of MP every time. We can just auto attack with uh, Cecil. Granted, I'll probably still summon Dragon for holy damage if I had to. It's a monster. Just slow this door. Strain. Edge. I realized I got to attack like two people first before the door even targeted anybody, so. I'm definitely gonna be able to kill this without threats of being sent to the ninth dimension. That's some weak sauce. Oh, maybe not. Pop, pop, dead. No. Chink, dead. One of these should be a saving spot, I think. I'm just trying to go off a of memory from two years ago, I think. It was 2016 is the last time I played this, I believe. Four years ago, wow. Time goes by fast. Oh yeah, Fuma, Shurukens, they do so much damage. I wonder if they say... I believe it's like 200 attack damage, even though you only use it once. Yep. While wow, Shurukens only 50. Wow, that's a big... Four times as many as much damage. So it's like throwing four Shurukens in one Fuma Shuruken. And too bad, again, you can't, like, get him back <laughs> after you kill the enemy, but it'll be too OP, I guess, if they did it like that. So you have to, again, invest in these shurukens. And the Fuma shurukens are not cheap, <laughs> I remember. Maybe, like, 2,000 a pop or something like that. Alright, let's go ahead and do Dandara. In this auto attack. <laughs> Actually, so fast. Even Kane and Cecil uh, are faster than Rosa. Not the save room. Let's see this one or the next one. Again, this is the uh, good thing about what should I call it? Uh, active time because then uh, even though someone else is attacking or something the uh, ATB bar active time battle bar the yellow slash red bar at the bottom uh, continuously fills anyways but on wait it just waits <laughs> so you have to I mean I guess there's still benefits of that but still sometimes it's better to just have it keep rolling Let's see here. I forgot what I was doing. Like, what menu I was thinking about looking at. Oh. Gotta uncover this little bit right there. So, I believe this is just an empty room, but nah, I'll just fight the door, anyways.
No ninth dimension for us. I'll just keep missing. Oh, <laughs> jeez. Why? Why? I guess someone gets to die. That's what you get for missing your targets, man. It's just a door, like... <laughs> how do you miss a door that's just chilling there? That doesn't make sense. I understand if like, the door is moving and stuff, but... Come on. <laughs> it's just chilling there. It either has items or has nothing. It has items. Black cow. It's another head, head <laughs> uh, equipment for itch. You know, it's not for bat, not like a Batman thing, but I'm pretty sure it's pretty close. It's more for defense though, but yeah, that's probably good to have defense. Said enough though. Five strength versus having more. I feel like it's not enough right now. And I can have plenty of Kotetsu, so let's not worry about that. I think for throwing objects, it takes into account the attack damage, and then it does so much damage based on that. <clears throat> I'm not quite sure again how it multiplies it or calculates it, but it does what it does. It is what it is. Oh, more bats. Just auto attack these bats. F these bats up. Well, bam. Well, bam, bam. Oh, I didn't die. So oh, I keep forgetting about that. Okay, it's so one bat's down. I really need to break these bats. Against fire, I forgot. But they're dead. 3,000 for a sword swipe. Some good damage right there. Let's finish this map off and head to the next area. Three red fangs. Red fangs cast fire guy. Not 100% sure. I think that's the case. Yeah, as long as they don't miss, it should be fine. But once they miss, it's over. Someone's getting sent to the ninth dimension. And of course, you can always count on magic to do the damage. I think it. Yeah, magic's pretty much guaranteed. I don't think they can really dodge magic in this game. Maybe in any Final Fantasy, yeah, I had to research on that. But otherwise, I don't think you can dodge magic attacks. Oh, wow. <coughs> All right. Oh yeah, I forgot I don't really need to cast Fearga. Because we already killed these guys so fast. But maybe. Never mind. <laughs> Bye. It should be death after these messages. Yes. I don't think I need anything. High potion. Phoenix down. Secret door. Surprised. The weak against fire? No electricity. It's just auto attack. Uh, can't go back.
Nice paralysis. <laughs> paralysis. Fake door. Yep. It's gonna auto attack. So I probably should have Rose up pretty again. Oh, yeah, and the bat has uh, electricity immunity. And of course, I auto attack it. <laughs> That's okay. How much regular fire is gonna do? Two thousand maybe? Oh, I guess we won't find out. It's a monster. Yeah, got kinda wish the door had a uh, Weakness instead of just DPSing as fast as you can. I don't know if I'll uh, cast fast enough because everyone's just auto attacking that much faster. Oh well. Save my MP. Another safe room? Nope. Another empty room. room splits off like this because I don't know which way I should go. So I'm just break the bat. Break the bat! And then I'll go attack. Had like 58 H HP left, but just overkill it. So I think this time the right way is going down. It's a monster! Nobody's missed their shot, so I should die. Right here! Yeah. Hopefully there's something in here. But there's nothing! It's very lame. That's alright. Silent Bell. I believe the Silent Bells uh, attract enemies, so if you really want to fight something, you would cast that or uh, use it from your inventory on the regular overworld. Weakness. Ah, no prayers. So sad. I wonder if I should put. Uh, or. Have holy arrows for Rosa, just so it does the holy damage to this vampirus, just for the extra damage. Now I feel like Final Fantasy five and six, or not five and six, four and six, are the have the biggest party size. 
what am I doing? So I put holy arrows on Rosa, that's what I was doing. Mm. Or I can just do this, because it's more accuracy. Yoichi arrows. Because yeah, in this one obviously I have five party members. In six you also get five party members, I believe. Everything else, three has four. Five has four. Uh, seven, eight, nine have three. Uh, whoop. Ten has three. Eleven's MMO. Twelve, you get three as well. What's <laughs> it? What's after that? Uh, Thirteen. Thirteen, you get. Three. All the parts of 13 you get three. And then 14 is another MMO and 15 you get four. Though technically you only play as Noctis the main character. But you have four party members. Nowadays though you, you can uh, switch between the characters. Before you were just locked to playing Noctis but they added the rest of the cast so you can play as them. Instead of just uh, Noctis. Either way, it doesn't matter to me. Uh, I feel like since Noctis can use any weapon, he's pretty much the other characters. Pretty much. But again, it's just if you want to be as them, then you can. <laughs> we actually have items in here. Dry ether. And you. Next potion. Yeah, a lot of these items are really for clutch moments, but since I have healers, there's really no point. Granted, of course, the uh, MP heals definitely important if you're fighting against a boss that you know, you don't have time, or you don't, or you need, <laughs> I should say, to, uh, you need to cast and use MP. And so, the only way to restore MP during a fight to the Osmos, Rose's Prayer, or using an item. Gale. Yeah, I'm leveling up a lot. The edge is almost, uh, caught up quote unquote and I wonder if um, Edge has a different experience curve because again he uh, came to the game late and so of course uh, he has to you know catch up same with Cecil uh, you actually restart your leveling because he switches from Dark Knight to Paladin and that resets his uh what his uh levels <laughs> so he goes back to level one and technically he actually started as level four or five with Cecil as a dark knight but yeah once he becomes paladin he goes all the way back to level one but again they probably you know made it so he leveled up pretty quickly because otherwise he would never really catch up with everybody else but I wonder if anyone actually mapped out um people's experience, like what they need.
What if I should just try to auto attack it to death before Rydia casted that? Oh, Rosa's doing 2200 now. That's good news. <laughs> I was like, I can't get all the squares. Break the bat. Break the bat. Kill the vampires. Vampire Fang. I believe it cast a drain, which is pretty nice. I believe that's the way forward, of course. But I see there's a rope down. <laughs> so for some reason, I just like spammed through the menus to auto attack. And I could have accidentally spammed auto attack for uh, Rydia as well, but she happened to be the slowest one, so. We get to break the bat. I feel like that's a line in Batman Arkham City or maybe an Arkham Asylum. Something that Joker would say. Got to break the bat. Okay, cool. This goes all the way around. I'm going to go down that rope, though. Before I go down those steps to the next area. Pretty sure I be, should be seeing the boss pretty soon. All oh, the ropes right there. I was like, if this was the way forward. I think it should be item air. Nope. Oh, it's a fake rope. <laughs> Cecil's like, nope. Not going down that way. Because I can't. I wonder if there's another rope. And this one actually goes down. Yep. <laughs> the other one's a fake rope. Nope, this one is also a fake rope. That's hilarious. Just a waste of our time. Luckily, there's no like encounters or anything, but that's pretty funny. Break the bat. Now, I kind of wish there was a, an item that gives you auto haste. I don't know if there is one. Definitely there are in different games, but I don't think they uh, thought about it for this game. But yeah. Because I'll definitely put on Rydia if I could, so she can just you know, break everybody. Break the bat, break the bowl, just break everything. Oh wow, that damn is too strong. That break is even stronger. Oh my, wow, almost at a, uh, what? Uh, 10, wait, a million gil? Right? Oh, only 100,000 gil, so sad. <laughs> okay. Seems to be a small area right here. Some last minute items, I guess. Oh yeah, this, uh, 
one encounter is about to happen, I think. <laughs> it's got a no reason for uh, the map. Oh, what? Wait. Okay, I was like, what else is there to... Ooh, Mega Elixir. Mega Elixir heals both MP and HP to full. Definitely not worth using. That's for the whole party. Because the regular Elixir <laughs> heals for one, obviously. Forgot about that. Uh, okay. That was just another one of the regular doors. I thought it was one of the other... Or a specific encounter we're going to have to deal with pretty soon. Wow, don't miss. That's how we get ourselves sent to the ninth dimension. Pretty much should call it the Shadow Realm. That's where we're going. Alright, we hit that 100k again. Alright, here we go. Dark Kalista. <laughs> Alright. So I believe I remember what happens next, so... Let's go ahead and... Get ready for that. Well, actually, wait. It's not yet. Uh, because there's another yep mm, boss fight this is what I thought it was going to be but here it is now the walls they're moving this cave was designed to protect the crystal. This must be the last line of defense in case someone attempts to escape with it. And I guess we'll just have to smash it. Yep, this is the demon door. Uh, let's haste Kane. I'll, uh, I think I just auto attack, right? I want to hope that it's weak against this. It looks like it's not. Uh, it's Berserk. Kane. Ah, oh, Radio. <laughs> That's so bad. I can buy all the wall. I mean, it's again a living thing, so let's go ahead and buy it. Let's go ahead and slow the wall. Because pretty much by the time it gets to you, um, it can either A start attacking you, or I think in some games you just automatically die. And I don't remember which one this game is. Yeah, this is definitely a reoccurring. Uh oh. Theme in these games. Uh, you sooner yourself. Oh, don't miss. Stop missing, guys. Especially if you have like 90 plus percent. Again, you see the wall coming, you know, so how can you. <laughs> how do you miss? How much does this do? 3500. I think I'm going to use Leviathan. Well, I should probably throw as well. Let's use Leviathan. Let's throw. Shuriken. Eat Shuriken! 
Oh, that's not that much damage. Let's watch this Leviathan summon. Tidal wave. Oh wow. Yeah, I have not seen this yet. That's not enough damage. You missed. This is not good. <laughs> I don't know how much further it needs to go before it can start doing this craziness on us. Looks like one more, because it's about to reach uh, Kane. Wow. Uh, uh, it's dead. It's not dead. It's dead now. <laughs> I got a little scared there. I feel like that's the closest it's been in a long time. And again, it's probably because I haven't really, uh... What should I call it? Grinded le Oh, that's a lot of experience! Assembly, uh, automatic level up for everybody. Death! There it is. Arise. Nice. Arise is... Resurrection plus full HP uh, regeneration. We did it! Heh. And don't try possessing any other walls either. Alright. I'm just gonna go ahead and let things play out. I was gonna kind of do some other stuff, but. Yeah, I'm just gonna let things happen the way they are meant to happen. Oh yeah, Let's see if I can osmos. Cause I can't osmos from the vampires, cause she did. Ah, <laughs> it's only 10. Only 10 uh, MP. That's okay. I can try uh, osmosing from something else. That's okay, I'll also use this tent right here. Should I use a tent? Should I use a cottage? How many cottages do I have? I have 10. Eh, might as well, because radio is so low on MP, so... I'm just having, uh... <laughs> so, where would you get the cottage from? Mm, it's found in my pocket. But, uh, your radio is so low on MP that using a tent only heals 100 uh, MP. So, if I use the cottage, it fully restores everything, so... There's that. Up for the long trek out. I, uh, I was gonna say, at least I know the way out, but it's gonna take a while. There's a auto attack. <laughs> Stop missing. It's okay. I'm trying to try my best to just get out of here. Wait, is that a rope? That is a rope. Is that a rope to nowhere? That'd be hilarious. Actually, that is the rope to get out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I <laughs> went to the other door, it would have been an empty plane of existence. Right, it should be the way back. Uh, uh, surprised. I wonder if I can break these. 
Well, I guess I could have tried death as well, but it's too late for that. Yep. Oh, break is always a nice touch. I believe all, oh, I was gonna say I believed all the doors came back, but they didn't. I believe break is definitely cheaper than death, so let's not try death. Uh, eventually, I'm gonna. Oh, I should have just auto attack because I did so much damage to it already. Oh well. But uh, once we get to the moon, which is pretty much the last level slash like. Zone, I guess, because there's a you know the normal world. Now we're in the underworld. And then we go to the moon. So there's like three places that we went to. And uh, yeah, once we get there, I guess we can start testing death on certain enemies. Definitely the harder <laughs> enemies to kill. Feel, again, I think I will still meet the two string deadline I'm putting for myself. Because, let's think. Again, if I get caught by the side quest stuff, then that might add a stream, but that's okay. Just want to get that thorough experience, <laughs> Final Fantasy experience. Yeah, these guys. I have a feeling they're not going to be as deadly now that I'm hella strong. As you can see, I just. I could have just auto attacked or something, but. Be safe and break it. Break it. I'm still sad that they don't give that much experience, despite how deadly they can be. Oh shit. I did it again. Do it again. I auto attacked it. With 3D. It's okay. King does so much damage, anyways. Three. Yep. Wow, just two attacks. I was thinking uh, Seaside didn't attack it too. Yas. Yeah, I think the second one is the save room. Not like I really have to save, but I'm just paranoid like that. Game can crash. I don't know, that's like the only <laughs> thing I'm worried about is game crashing out of nowhere for no reason. Just because. Uh, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I'm probably gonna stop playing this pretty soon. Break the bat, break the bat. I guess I should break this guy, girl, monster. So I'm not really f afraid of uh, Scorch as much anymore. Oh wow. Oh, I didn't realize how uh, low on HP uh, Rosa is was. Is is.
Let's see. Still does a lot of damage to, uh... Who's his face? Edge. <clears throat> but he has a higher HP pool now, so he can withstand two of them at least. He has low, uh... Spirit? Magic defense? Oh. Down the rope we go. I believe, yeah, the exit's top right. That should be... it for the sealed cave. What? Cain, return to me, my pawn. Deliver me the crystal. Go, Bears. Cain. Don't listen. Resist him. It's alright. I, I'm back in control of myself. <laughs> Shoulder tackles Cecil. Lost the dark crystal. You filthy double-crosser! Kane, what are you doing? You underestimate the strength of my abilities. I had but slackened your friend's leash, waiting for the proper moment to pull it tout. Tot? With this final crystal, the Tower of Babel will be made complete. Come, Kane. Kane, don't listen to him. Kane. The crystals are all assembled. We can open the way to the moon at last. Go back here! Ha 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 ha. Kane. Unbelievable. <laughs> uh. But we already knew that kind of, anyways, because, like, uh, Gobez's control over Kane only, again, fell apart or whatever after freaking, uh, Tella used meter on him, so of course Golbez can't like. Um, I forgot it. Can control Kane and stay alive, I guess, because again, meteor is pretty much a killing technique, <laughs> magical technique. All right, why Kane? Why would you betray us again? All right, let's uh, talk to Mister Dwarf King guy. See what he has to say. Um, so we do need to find a way out of here. Oh, I've been waiting your return. You have the crystal, I assume. We failed. What? So he holds Altum now? Then there is nothing more we can do. Not unless the legend of the lunar whale were to come true. The lunar whale? It is a great ship, said to have been built in an age long past. Birth from womb of Dragon's Maul. Those are the words of the Mycidian legend. You know of Mycidia? It's a city of mages on the surface. What? You mean to tell me Mycidia is real? Well, I mean, these dwarves, like, <laughs> live underground, so how do they know what the upside looks like? Very much so. Its elder has confirmed, or confined himself to their Tower of Prayer, where he prays for us even now. He prays, you say. Could it be? What do you mean? He may be trying to revive the whale. No, he must be. It is our only hope. Messidia, that is our answer. You must hurry to Messidia. But this passage to the surface is sealed now. And we can't even get near the Tower of Babel. Not now that all the crystals are there. It's a good thing you've got me that, isn't it? Mm -mm -mm. Sid! Yeah, Mrs. Sid is back in the game. I'll test the drill to the Falcon's bow. Then you'll be able to burrow your way back to the surface. But your wounds, have they healed? Come now. We've got bigger things to worry than a few scratches on old Sid. You really think you can do it? Think? I'm Sid. There's nothing I can't do. 
Let's get to work. <laughs> this time it's uh, the male dwarves helping him out instead of the female uh, infirmary dwarves. And again, he's still hammering this guy. That's it for you. <laughs> That's so funny. It's funny because like they're doing all this stuff, but oh no, Sid! Sid! Ah, <laughs> also I'm gonna join my party. You always have to overdo it, don't you? I think this is the part where I finally have to bow out and leave the rest of you young ones. I'm no good for much outside of fixing up airships in this condition anyhow. <laughs> Had to go show me up, didn't you, old man? Get well soon. You too. Look after Cecil and Rosa for me, you hear? Got it. You just take your time and recover. Cecil, Rosa, be careful. You too, Sid. Go on now. I don't remember you having enough time to be sitting around talking to a crazy old man like me. Take care of yourself, Sid. All right. But yeah, I was going to say, like, all you have to do is attach a drill to the tip, you know, the front of the ship. But he's, like, hammering all over the place, like, <laughs> is that really necessary? Unless, again, probably it's so they can, like, rework the uh, mechanisms that they would have to attach to, like, have a drill function correctly. But I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? It was just a silly little cutscene anyways. Alright. Let's go ahead and save. Is that drill? That looks so funny. Alright, mm, so the way out is over here. And we out of here! Wait, <laughs> so why are there mountains? Oh well. Okay. And. We're supposed to go to Mysidia. Oh, so now we have two airships. I wonder which one's better. Or maybe. Neither. I'm assuming the Enterprise is better. Especially because I can't land here. Uh, where's Mysidia? That's not Mysidia. Where's Mysidia? I think. No, this is. Uh... Oh, this is Mysidia. This is not Mycidia. <laughs> this is mist where we found Ridia. All right, where would it be? Why do I not remember? So here's Baron. Uh, well, why not just fly there, right? Because otherwise, I would have taken the uh, secret tunnel passage. This is. Not for bull? Wait, wait, no, this is Mycidia. Yeah, because uh, after I go here, that's where they task us to go to the mountain to uh, prove stuff. Anyways, I've been waiting for you. Come, we must go to the Tower of Prayer. <laughs> Back to this uh, still wallpapers stuff. Birth from Wound of Dragon's Maul, and born unto the stars, by light and darkness cast aloft, in dream tide oaths resworn, moon is swathed in ever light, ne'er again to no eclipse, earth with hollowed bounty reconciled. So I read that and I don't understand a thing. <laughs> but So you'd think they'd make it so it's like a poem, right? But it's just some mumble jumble. Prophecy must be made reality. 
There is no other time but now. Lend me your energy. He sounds like a voice actor from Dynasty Warriors. It's so funny how fast we get all these airships, like, one right after the other. A voice spoke to me in the midst of our prayers. Go to the moon, it said. He awaits you there. To the moon? But how? The lunar well is a ship from the moon. According to the writings I've discovered, there should be a teleportation crystal on board in addition to the crystals that serve to power its flight. That crystal be, uh, controls travel between here and the moon. Speak to it, and it will transport you between the two faster than you can even blink. I see. We will search for it. Alright. I think that's a good place to stop. Um... So yeah, looking at the old save data, it takes about 20 or 30 minutes or 30 hours. So I feel like I'm on pace again, as long as I don't like do too much extra stuff. All right. 